So what do we uh, do uh, to secure right, a high score? We basically want to first um, know where we are going. Students are still very resistant to planning nowadays. I think that is um, typical. However, um, the benefits are really too um, attractive for us to give up planning, right? So we want to tell students that planning gives you a bit of a road map to know that if you're in a hurry, you want to know exactly where you're moving from, from, from point to point in your story. Now, some students aim to write about six, seven pages, and that's a lot to write for uh, within 45 minutes, right? So they cannot afford to change their minds halfway through. So planning helps them keep them on track. And they are, there's a certain discipline that they must uh, develop to follow through with their plans. So one of the reasons students tell me that they don't plan is because I won't follow my plan. Then you're not planning well and you don't have the discipline to follow, right? So on your way from home to Connectus, uh, you will take the shortest path because you want to save time, right? You won't go all the way to Jurong and then go back to Woodlands and then come back to, you know. So we want to make sure that they're on track. So that's why we plan, right? So we need to plan the composition effectively. First, um, they need to determine the meaning of the theme. Make sure they understand what the theme is about, right? What are some synonyms of the theme and um, how to develop a story that fully captures the idea, right? That's being presented. And um, looking at the three pictures, your child should try to describe each picture, maybe just scribble some notes beside the pictures, right? And to link them with the theme. It may seem very obvious, but under exam conditions, you'll be surprised, right? So interpreting the, the, the theme is very important. Describing the pictures uh, clearly is very important. And then making sure that they do not change um, the theme, the story, um, as well as the, as the pictures. Hi, this is Dr. Daniel Chua. I hope the video that you have just watched uh, will be helpful to your child in preparation for PSLA English. So if you are interested to sign up for any of our programs, please feel free to check out this uh, QR code and then you can then uh, find out more about what we do to help our students at Connectors Academy. All right, thank you.